that's what I hear across many industries, some doing well, some having a tough time in this, including cricket of course, that's doing well. <laughs> What's your first reaction uh, to this budget across all your various sectors? You can choose anyone you want. I think it's a pretty uh, balanced budget, you know, I mean from a from a textile perspective, you know, there's a sort of a balancing out of excise to 8%. Cotton textiles has, has some benefits of 4% uh, on excise. But I think overall it's a pretty balanced budget. I think uh, as you pointed out correctly that everyone was expecting this uh, big bang sort of budget. Um, and I think that, that's incorrect, um, at least in my mind, to, to anticipate. I think, you know, he's continued a lot of reform. He's focused more on infrastructure. Uh, focused mainly on, on rural India where I personally believe uh, a lot of focus needs to be put and I think a lot of focus hasn't been put. You know, talk about things like um, 25 kilo of wheat or rice to those below the poverty line, guaranteed, um, you know, guaranteed employment to certain people in terms of wages at least, 100 rupees. So it's all these little things which, which make a difference, you know, protecting our borders. We've been talking about protectionism of our borders and, and, and infiltration because of lack of jobs available in India. So that's going to happen. I think he's, he's done a pretty good job even on education. He's talked about IITs, IIMs, you know, getting a stimulus. Um, on the health side, he's talked about, you know, the smart cards being available uh, across, which I think is, is good. You get access to, to health. So overall, pretty uh, good for rural. It's easy to implement. It's easy to say 9% is what we are going to aim for, but what is there in this to make it get there. It's easy, you know, lots of Sorry. pleasant to hear statements, but actually on the ground, what has he done? He's tinkered a little bit with personal income tax. He's got rid of fringe benefit tax, but a big, a big nuisance, but not a big deal actually in terms of budget uh, revenues and expenditures and uh, abolished uh, commodity transaction tax. Anything else do you feel implement all talk and no action? I, 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 I think you're being harsh um, by saying all talk and, and no action in my own personal view because I think, you know, he's just come in. Uh, it's been five weeks uh, of preparation. I, I think one would look at, uh, one should look at a five-year term. And I think also one should look at how it's step-by-step -step growth which is inclusive, uh, not some sort of bang-bang growth which uh, gets you into trouble two, three years later. So I, I really believe that he's looking at a lot of the fundamentals, maybe not fundamentals <coughs> where you and I uh, see on a daily basis, but definitely fundamentals which are very valid to the common man. And, and, and eventually that is where we will get our growth from in India. Got it. Thanks very much, Neswari. Uh, 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 more Thank positive you. voice than we've heard uh, many others say thanks very much for bringing out those uh, key aspects of the budget. Take a short break now when we are back. We've got the finance sector, we've got cars, automobiles, all kinds of things. Sir. That's in a moment. See you there.